What's up, Wayne Barron here with Dark Effect Studios, and we are inside of Camtasia 9. And what we're going to do here, let's say that you have a, um, you're trying to show people how to log on to a website or maybe fill out a form or something, and you want to obscure certain items to where they cannot see it. So uh, what we got here is just basically uh, the scrolling up and then scrolling down of our window. So the first thing that we want to do is come over here, go to 100% so that we can actually see it better. And then it's going to come up like so. Let's go ahead and choose our hand tool. Bring this down to right here. Okay, so then that way we can gain full access to it as it's coming and going back down. Okay, so we want to come over here and grab a hold of our annotations. Come over here to our blur. And then we want to choose our blur. We want to drag our blur right here. And then select our selection tool. And we're just going to cover up my name right here, my username. So we're going to drag this over here. What we're going to do here is we're going to come over here to animation. And then we're going to choose the animation tab. And then we're going to click on the custom. And then we're going to drag the custom right here on top of our, our blur. Now, we want to drag our custom all the way to the end, and that way it starts off at the beginning and then runs all the way. So we're going to drag it right here to the very beginning, grab a hold of this, put it right here. Now, you can use the, the period and the comma on your keyboard. The period will go forward and the comma will go backwards. Okay, so now what we're going to do is that we're going to go forward until it moves and then we're going to slide it up and as we slide it up you can watch right there it will create a little red circle so then we move it up move it up and then basically we just keep on moving like so all the way up to the top whenever you start getting to the end of it because of where you had it placed at from the beginning then it will be a little bit hard to uh, to work with it. So you just got to sit there and play around with it. But you can go in and you can fine tune it. So like this area right here, you can move that up. And then you can just work with it. And then you can make it look really, really good. Like I said, you just got to go in and got to fine tune it. And always remember to use your, your period it goes forward and your comma goes backwards. Or your greater than sign goes forward and your less than sign goes backwards. And so that's pretty much how it's done. I am Wayne Barron. This is Dark Effect Studios. Y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.